Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing my Finish 5 by Cinco de Mayo. Uh, it's sort of a Project Pan uh, video. It's kind of a fun spin on Project Pan. And I believe Meg's Makeup 8 here on YouTube came up with this idea. So I thought it was a great, excellent, fun idea. So I'm going to go ahead and show you my 5 products that I want to use up by uh, May the 5th of 2015. So I'm going to start off here with this um, Revlon Cream Eyeshadow Palette. You may have um, seen it in my uh, 2014 Project Pan video. And I'm going to show you what I have left um, in this palette. Um, I'll show you this way. I have left half of this cream eyeshadow and half, uh, not really half, um, almost one full of these um, eyeshadows. This is a nice brown, um, sort of more matte, but still creamy. And this one is kind of um, a really beautiful, interesting color. When it's sheer, it's almost pinkish, light purple, and then you could definitely add more to make it closer to this color, and it's very, very beautiful. So I think that there's a good chance I will finish these two way before May the 5th. Okay, and next up I have uh, lip products. This one is the Rimmel Lipstick that you may recognize from my Project Pan. Again, this is the Rimmel Lipstick, um, the lasting finish kind, and it's in 028 Celeb, and this is how much I have left of this. So really not much at all. And I'm definitely um, pretty confident that I can finish it up. Another carryover, and that will be the last carryover from Project Pan 2014, is this Revlon Lipstick in Soft Nude. Let me give you the number. It's 070, and the kind of lipstick is the Revlon Color Burst. I'm not sure if they still make these or not. They may be discontinued, but I'm not quite sure. That this is what this looks like and how much I have left. So not much at all. So um, I'm pretty confident that I can use it up before um, May 5th comes. And then um, another lip product is this Buxom Lip Gloss. And this is in the color White Russian. I actually have two of these in the same exact color because they, I bought two different sets where the same lip gloss was included. So I definitely want to work through my lip gloss, first of all, and second, I want to work through my duplicates, which at this point, this is the only one that I can think of that I have. So that's that. And then um, all these four products seem pretty easy to accomplish, but I do have a more challenging item, which I will consider my fifth item. And it is part of a eyeshadow lip and cheek palette from Sephora, which I showed in my makeup inventory. Uh, this is what it looks like. So I'm just going to open it up. I'm actually, you can pop it out of this. And so I'm going to show you. This is what it looks like. It's part of a palette um, that comes with five of these with different colors. And again, it's from Sephora and I purchased it around 2010 or the end of 2009. So this has all these eyeshadows. Um, I used one of them up, um, that was a while ago. So I have nine of them left, but the pans are pretty small and it's pretty manageable to use it up. And also the colors are more everyday colors for me. There are two lip products. One of them, uh, I'm wearing it on right now and it looks like it's, they're gonna go really quickly. And this is a blush, which may be more difficult to finish up. So all of these products, I will consider it as one item for Finish 5 by Cinco de Mayo. And that is all I have for you. Uh, please let me know how often you'd like me to do updates. I'm thinking once every month, but I could do once every two weeks um, if you would like to see that. Um, and then, of course, if I finish things very, very quickly, I'll do um, uh, updates much sooner so that it's more... Uh, interesting. So hopefully this video was somewhat enjoyable. Um, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.